What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another Leal Legacy Classic Cartoon Commentary. Oswald the Lucky Rabbit and my pal Paul. And Oswald's pal Paul is referring to Paul Samuel Whiteman. An American band leader, composer, orchestral director, and violinist. He was the lead in most popular dance bands in the United States from the 1920s to 30s. And there's Oswald proving yet again that in classic cartoons, every animal can be used as an instrument. <sighs> this is it. This is where Oswald is exposed. Oh no. Milly Vanillied. Wow, these people are really mad that Oswald was lip syncing. Oh my god. <laughs> Oswald's taking this hard. Oh, Oswald. Oswald's taking this really hard. Oh no. This this doesn't feel right. Oh, oh god. I feel like the animation was intended to be wider. Wow, why do you want help now? You, <laughs> I mean, the noose didn't work, but the tree coming down, I mean, either way, you're, were you just like feigning for attention? Is that Paul? That's Paul Whiteman. <sighs> it's fascinating. Oh, Paul's gonna be the one to save Oswald. So apparently, this rare and whimsical cartoon was used to promote the King of Jazz and makes reference to same. I don't know, that doesn't, that doesn't seem right how that was written, but... So apparently... Paul <laughs> Whiteman! Oh wow, all his buttons are even... musical. He sounds a lot like Mickey Mouse in this. Oswald, that is. So this cartoon was a promotional tool for this jazz artist. That's pretty brilliant and pretty amazing. And what an interesting marketing tact, seeing this new style of, I don't know what you would call this, because cartoons were still new at the time. But Paul Whiteman or his marketing team or some whatever he had back then. Oh, look at you go, Oswald. Is Paul okay with you ripping his car apart to use it as music or instruments? But yeah, back to the point. What a cool, cool idea to use this new medium as a marketing tool. <laughs> what is that? Is that the, just like the emblem on the top, front of the car? Brilliant, Oswald. Brilliant. <gasps> Paul's gonna be bummed. Oh, look at you, Paul. <sighs> oh, I hope he wasn't trying to get anywhere important. That's actually a Paul Whiteman original. <laughs> are they gonna? Are they having like a dueling banjos situation? Oh man, Oswald's not happy. Oswald, he's a professional. If you were that talented, why would you lip sync his music to begin with? <sighs> Alright, I could have I could have done without this part, I guess. This doesn't seem like it has much to do with the uh, playing music. Oh look at that! Uh, 
Now for the pliers, the feet kind of make sense, but the hammer just sprouted limbs. Nope. I love how in like classic animation, it really seemed like animators were just, you know, almost wanting to show off. Like this has nothing to do with anything in the plot. See, like the tools weren't even used. <laughs> but who are, the animators just really wanted to, I don't know, just about having fun. Where do these people come from? Do they look like they're related to the person dancing on the, what was that, radiator? <sighs> like, this has no other purpose than to just play, you know? <sighs> I wonder if Paul could actually dance like that in real life. Yeah, unnecessary. Oh no, Paul. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, Oswald went from bad to way worse. Ah! Oh. Are they just gonna laugh it off now? My pal. Oh. Oh, okay, so the tiding title is a little misleading, huh? Oswald and uh, Paul weren't really pals, huh? <laughs> that was that was fun, and being used as a marketing instrument for Paul Whiteman. It's pretty funny that in the end, Oswald and Paul did not turn out to be pals. <laughs> so, <laughs> thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, please subscribe to our little YouTube channel here. Uh, hit the subscribe button, the ding dong bell to be notified anytime we put out new content. Um, thumbs up, leave a comment, tell your friends to do the same. Uh, all Leo Legacy creations and content are sponsored by Skeleton Crew Brand. Check out skeletoncrewbrand.com or leolegacy.com and take a look at all our streetwear and apparel designed by yours truly. Um, scope out the other things we got going on at leolegacy.com. Uh, video game streams, movie commentary, more cartoon commentary, podcasts. Podcasts like my podcast, Radnorock, Leo Legacy's Radnorock, and Nerd Cult Underground, available anywhere and everywhere. Podcasts can be found, iTunes. Stitcher, Spotify, Google Play, you know, you name it. If you, if you find podcasts there, you'll find us there as well. And LeoLegacy.com. Just stop on by. See anything and everything that I've got going on at LeoLegacy.com. And until next time, folks, thanks for watching. See you around. <laughs>